I brought you out here tonight where we had our very first date. After so many months of wooing you. <laughs> right. right. <laughs> you gave me tough time, yeah? I know. <laughs> I knew I had fallen hopelessly in love with you after our very first date here. And that was why I chose this place. To ask... To ask this very important question. woman on earth. You complete me entirely. Please. Would you be the mother of my unborn children? Please marry me. Yes. <laughs> so beautiful. You like? I love. <laughs> That's good. So we celebrate. Sure. <laughs> to us. To us. Because this is meant to be a surprise. Okay, wait, like, just can careful. we just get careful. there already? Okay, are you ready? Yes, are you I'm ready. ready. Ta -da. Oh my god. Wait, you've been enlightening my life. You've been everything to me. And I want you to take an integral part of my life and let's just be together. You're not going to be the mother of my child or my children. You're going to be everything in my world. Please say yes. Marry me. <laughs> yes. Yes. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! I'm so happy. Thank you so much, babe. You see? It's celebration now. Yes. Let's celebrate. <laughs> Whoa! I'm so happy. I'm gonna make you the happiest woman you could ever ever meet in your life. Thank you, babe. Thank you so much for bringing light into my life. Wow. <laughs> Sorry, I'm too excited. I just couldn't. I just like, spoke this little bit. Wow. Man. My new purchase uh, was delivered directly to me. Okay. You like the way it looks? Uh, yes. A good, a good, a good, a good, 
a good car. <laughs> beautiful engine and a beautiful body. Look around. Just, just, Chief, just, it? just go that side. Look around. You will like it. What is it for? Just like it. Just go around. <laughs> is it? Look, look, look is around. it for me? Look around. Look. Yes. Ah! 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 Like I it? love it. I love How it. did you know that I wanted it, Lexus? <laughs> <laughs> oh so beautiful. <laughs> will you marry me? To say. Please don't turn me down. Yes, <laughs> yes, that, yes. <laughs> that's that's my baby. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> you have to stop calling me senator. Uh, I'm sorry. It's just that I like the way it sounds. Considering the fact that you've been there for four times, it's just kind of like a respect. It's all right. Whatever makes you happy, makes me happy. <laughs> <sighs> you know, I really appreciate this. I really do. And I didn't ask you for it. <laughs> oh, darling. A man spends on whom he loves. Oh. I love you, and I'm sure you're not in doubt of that. <laughs> not at all, not at all. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Come, let's go back inside and celebrate. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mom, four men. Four men has proposed to me. What do I do? Is that supposed to be a problem? What? I just don't see what the problem is. Mom, I'm literally shaking right now. I don't know what to do. <laughs> oh my darling. You are young. Hmm? If you didn't have up to three suitors, I would have asked questions. <laughs> Come, darling. You're just stressed. Hmm? Go inside, freshen up, and when you come out, we will sit down and solve this your little problem. <laughs> Mommy, it's not little. It's not little. Come on, go inside. Go inside. Oh, go and freshen up, okay? Oh. Mm, it is okay. <laughs> mm. <laughs> mm. Eric. It's just a fine face if you ask me. He works in a multinational company, yes, but... He's still stingy, in my opinion. Yeah, he keeps saying that he wants him and his wife to share financial burden. Imagine that. That's only for girls who don't have options, which is not your case, darling. You see why I always say you should spread your eggs in different baskets? <laughs> yes, Mom. Imagine, he just got you 15,000 Naira perfume on your birthday. Who does that? But I like the perfume and it's really nice. It smells really great, Mom. Sweetheart, go for the man who will get you the perfume company. Oh, Mommy, this one is okay. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. I don't want to hear about him again. Hmm. AGK. He has a heart to give. <laughs> yes, but Mom. unfortunately, he doesn't have much to give. <laughs> And you can't give something out of nothing, you know. You know, Mom, when I learned how much his salary was, that guy practically gives me everything. Yeah. Yeah. So kind. <laughs> yes, Mom. Generous. <laughs> A man you can rely on. Yes, Mommy. But he has to go. Chief, chief. <laughs> 
my dear, look, just ignore those his scattered teeth and his big belly. <laughs> he's handsome on the inside. <laughs> he's young at heart. This is a man that knows how to take care of a young woman. <laughs> Mommy, please. With the way you are going now, I hope you are not trying to suggest that I go with this old man. Um, because the way you've been rejecting Eric, rejecting Eddie K, I hope you are not suggesting that it's this old man I should marry. Uh -uh. Look at this one. <laughs> Chief owns companies. His wealth and fame. Where it will get you to. People will struggle for generations and will not be able to get to where you get to by the time you're 30. Why? Because he got me a simple car. Senator just raised the bar, mommy. <laughs> You've only known Chief for what? One month? And he's already doing things for you that other men will take years to do. <sighs> mommy, he has three wives. He three has wives. married three times. Those are two different things. <sighs> What if what happened to those three women happened to me? Not on my watch. Not while I'm here. We will beat him at this game. It is not a game, mommy. It's marriage we are talking about. Uh, we are not talking about marriage, dear. We are plotting about marriage. How to get in, cash out, come out with dividends. I planned myself well, and that's why I married your father. And I never had to work a day in my life, even long after he died. Mommy, not chief, please. Whatever. Let me hold on to his picture. Hmm. Ovier, ex-senator, widower, a man of few words. A man who puts his wallet where his mouth is. Now that's a man. He might not have as much as Chief, uh, but I know he has money and property scattered everywhere. I say you pick one of the two. Which two? Ah. Mommy, it's very obvious that you're not ready to help me. I should pick out of the two men, old men for that matter. Where are you going to? I am leaving because you don't want to help me. Look here, young lady. You had better not bring any of those two young poverty stricken people here for me. You are clearly staring financial freedom in the face. And you want to leave it and embrace poverty. Mommy, Eric works in a multinational company. He's not broke. Considering the splitting of financial bills, we've been dating for two years now. He has never for once asked me for one naira. All this multinational company, multinational company that you've been singing like a song and disturbing my ears. How much is his salary? Is it not 500,000 naira per month? That is what Chief and Senator spend on our time. You think 500,000 is big money, right? Wait till you start having children and you want to give them the good life. Then you see that that money will go nowhere. Mommy, when we get to that bridge, we will cross it. Okay, we can manage. And besides, you are my mother. When we go broke, we will come to you. Are you not supposed to have my back? and a poverty-stricken husband. Uh -huh, no. I paved the way for myself. By myself. I earned every penny that I have. And I deserve the life that I'm living. I am doing my best to ensure that you go to be bigger and better than me. That should be enough for you. Mommy, not an old man, no. I'm not going to marry Chief. Please, I'm not even interested in Senator. All those old men, I'm not interested. Look at this one. <laughs> so, you think if I had married all those grow with me young men, I would have had all I have today to have given you the kind of life that you enjoyed? <laughs> no problem. Just bring one of them here. You could know me. <laughs> Rubbish. Yes, and that's because 
shopping. So if you wanted to buy up the whole world. What else can a woman do if not shop, shop, and shop? I know. <laughs> It looks like you didn't like the rose I gave you. Oh, come on, darling. You gave me bare roses. Plain. Who gives a woman plain roses these days? You have to give a woman roses wrapped in dollars. Oh, yeah? Mm hmm Wrapped in dollars. Yes, my love. That's the only way she will appreciate it. That's the code these days? <laughs> yes. Girl code. Not plain roses. Ah, it's boring. But those roses were expensive. I still they have good smell. Oh. Mm? So you're going to do mm? more, mm? more, more, more. <laughs> mm. Intoxicate me with the wine. Oh, that's love. my poet husband. <laughs> yes. Mona Lisa, men have named you. You're also like the lady with her mystic smile. Is it only cause you're lonely they have blamed you? Oh, the Mona Lisa strangeness in your smile. Do you smile to tempt a lover, Mona Lisa? Or is this a way to hide a broken heart? Many dreams have been brought to your doorsteps. They just died there, and they died there. Are you warm? Are you real, Mona Lisa? Or just a cold and only? Lonely walk was. You're the most beautiful woman in the world. As lovely as ever. Thank you. Just one thing missing. Okay. Just one thing missing. Just one thing. Hmm. Ready? Let me take you out to the most romantic evening. <laughs> sure. And I'm wearing this. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, I'm going to get ready. So, uh, what, what would you like me to wear? Honey, you're back. Yes, darling. Hmm. How are you? Ah, good. Ah. Good. Well. Oh, boy. How are you? I'm good. I must be very tired. Yes, uh, the day was quite uh, productive. Stressful, but productive. Mm -hmm. I'm happy. I'm happy. Okay. I'm so tired. <sighs> I am tired. I'm yeah. furnished. Mm -hmm. Um, honey, did you get the message I sent you concerning Enrolling Eric in a private music class? My friend has already enrolled his son. Mm? And you know he always bobs his head whenever music is playing. Danny, all children bob their head when music is playing. But then again, I want to say that, you know, my friend's son is about four years older than I <sighs> son. I think it might be a bit too early for him. Overwhelming for me. I know. But you know, it's always good to start on time. All right. All right. I agree with you. Mm 
I agree with you. Except that I still insist. I still maintain our son is a bit too young for this. But if you insist, <laughs> it's okay. I insist. I agree. So, uh, but can I have my phone now? Furnished. Okay. <sighs> Honey, I'm so sorry. The chef, he hasn't made lunch yet. Nicole, what's happening? This type of thing has happened before. And I asked the chef, and he said he asked you over and over again what he should prepare, and you were not able to give him an answer before you left. Honey, why are you talking like this now? Why are you talking like this? Huh? The other day, because I was late for my spa appointment, and then today I was rushing over to my mother's place. I didn't even hear my phone ring, or you didn't call me. Then allow the chef to make the decisions. Decisions? In my house? My kitchen? Oh, come on, honey, no. I don't want to stick to his menu. I'd rather stick to my own daily cravings. I believe you've had your daily cravings today. Yes, honey. And my son? Eric. <laughs> I got to meet by an ice cream. You know the way he acts whenever he sees meet by. Mommy oh. meets by. I got oh. him his favorite. <sighs> look, look, look. Darling, when mm. I, I discovered you couldn't cook, I got a chef. A chef I pay heavily. What's he doing in this house now? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Oh, come I'm on. wasting money. And my son is a growing child. He needs to eat healthy. Oh, come on, honey. Uh, it's not that deep. Huh? You, Lunch will you, soon you, be ready. You can't be starving me, yo. You can't be starving me like this. You can't be starving me. Uh, honey, you don't have to say this now. Don't talk like this. You can't be starving me. Uh, few minutes now. Lunch will be ready. Uh, you can't be starving me, yo. Starving you. Huh? Honey, can you eat some biscuits? It's very nice. At least you can use to hold your stomach before the lunch will be ready. This biscuit is nice. So the way you're just saying I'm starving you, I'm starving you. Eh? This is what I'm eating now. Talk now. It's not like later now it will be too late. Somebody will start rushing to the supermarket to buy something. I did my best. Darling, I'm home, and I've got a surprise for you. Darling. Yes. How was your day? Well, as beautiful as you are. Did you just say you got a surprise for me? Yes, darling. Okay. <laughs> so what's the surprise? The house you loved in Banana Island. <gasps> Are you for real? As real as my love for you. <laughs> you are the best husband in the world! <laughs> Banana Island! <sighs> you know you're happy. I love it, I love it! Oh my you're goodness. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Anything for you, my love. Anything for you. <laughs> my friend, when I entered that party, they knew that somebody has entered. <laughs> I was telling you now. I said, come, let's go. He said, no, you have something to do. She was there now. I beg you, with her nonsense red, 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 that she's always wearing up and down. I've always told that woman, change color. Uh -uh. Does she belong to a secret court? <laughs> ah! <laughs> Next time when I tell you, come, let's go, you will run. 
Uh -huh. <laughs> you know, you know. Oh, I don't joke with those type of things, my darling friend. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you trust me now. Huh? Mm. I told you, I told you. I said, come, let us go for this party together. But then you refused. It's your fault. Honey. <laughs> My dear friend, let me call you back, okay? I want to attend to something. All right. Bye bye. Oh, honey, I'm, I'm, I'm talking. I'm talking to you. Oh, honey, I think we should sort this this thing out, honey. Look, da da darling, I, I think we need to sort out this issue. Uh, what no, is all what? this now? What is all this? Ah! I can't have rest again because I'm in your house. What's all this nonsense? Somebody will just you still mad at me? Ah, 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 ah. What did you just say now? Yes, I am mad at you. Very mad at you. I asked you for a common Bentley for my 30th birthday. But what did you do? Nothing! You embarrassed me in front of my friends! Oh, honey, I, I got you the latest Range Rover Vela just last year. Uh -huh. Is there something you and your friends do with car except drive them? Hey, are you seriously asking me that? Oh, oh, honey, I gave you 20 million naira to start a business with. I mean, that's better. Even your car is still good. <laughs> 20 million naira to start a business. Uh -uh. Ask your friends now. Who gives people, their wives, money to start a business as a present? Huh? I never said, did I tell you that I want to start business? Did I tell you? Ah. Please, eh? You've already done your own, oh. Allow me to rest. Gave me money to start business. What is my business with we, we starting a business? Ha! Huh? I cannot stay in one place and rest. Just know my small Bentley, oh. How much? How much is Bentley? How much? Ha! Huh? It seems this man has become stingy. Definitely, Mom. Because he usually gives me anything that I want. I mean, anything. Hmm. And you've just been married for nine years. Hmm. I thought we could use a different approach. Since he's proved to be generous so far. But it seems I have to go back to the original plan. What plan, Mom? Don't worry about it, dear. <sighs> hmm. Let's dig around a little bit. Find out why he's suddenly stingy. Why would he want you to start supporting the family if he isn't broke? Or is he seeing another woman? <sighs> Let's just ask questions, dear. Then we'll know what to do. All right, Mom. Please, Mom, you really need to help me because I don't know what to do. It's not a problem, dear. Mom is on. Sister, 
Mommy, we give you a sister, okay? But for now, you do not have a sister, baby. Okay? Right? Okay. I love you. So, it's the room. I got you something. Lots of chocolates. Come back. So, Come baby, back here. I got you chocolates. I'm talking to you. And your meat pie. Come back here. Baby. I'm calling. So, mommy. Come baby. here. Don't let this make you feel bad at all, okay? You're a wonderful girl, you're a good girl. Your daddy's girl, and Eric is your brother, okay? It's all right. Driver to take her back to my parents. Why did you allow her into our matrimonial home in the first place? Huh? Before we got married, you promised me. You promised me that this girl was not going to come into this house. Why did you allow her in here? Pamela is 16 years old. And she keeps wondering why I have to go and visit her in her grandparents' house and not allow her to come visit me in my house. Listen, that could affect her confidence as a child. What is my business? Huh? Agreement is agreement. So stick to it. Come back here. I'm talking to you. What impudence is that? Now listen very carefully. Pamela is my child. Put yourself in her shoes. She's growing up and wondering why she cannot live with her parents when her father is alive. You've not even taken time to study that child. If you take time to study that child, you discover she's one of the coolest 16 year olds of this century. Listen very carefully. If you try, if you ever repeat what you did downstairs today, you see a side of me you don't like. I've told you. Nonsense. I don't blame you now. My people are marrying young people and marrying old man with baggage. It's because I have respect, though. I have home training. Otherwise, this thing you are just saying here now, I would have replied to you. I have home training, though. This man is talking to me, Pamela is a bookie. What's my business? What is my business? Mama, where is going on vacation? Of course, darling. We are. You know what? Next week when you get back from school, we will start preparing, okay? I'm sure Daddy has our tickets already. So don't worry. We are going on vacation, okay? Thank you so much for buying the tickets for the vacation. Yeah, yeah, yes. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> okay, you go to your room now and um, continue your cartoon. Huh? I'd like to talk to mommy a lot. Okay. recently to piss me off. No, darling. But if you remember, I was not in support of this trip to the Bahamas in the first place. I was on no, the... No, 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 no. Since when did we start deliberating over vacations like it's a bill? Since when? Since when did we start deliberating over vacation like we're passing a bill? I usually choose any place in the world I would love to visit and fix it. What changed? Nothing changed, honey. You will still go, but not now. 
Look, I, I made some heavy investments and I would like to have some returns on it before we can afford any lifestyle. Please just tell me the truth. Are you broke? Not really. It's just that, you know, in everything, there's a time to sow and a time to reap and that's where I am now. You see this preaching you are preaching? I am not interested. I work so hard. Vacation is the only time I have to rest my pretty head. And you must make it happen. Ah! How can you be this wicked? I don't even know. The only time I get to work, rest, you will still want to take it away from me. All this stress in this house, taking care of things, providing for you, making sure you are fine. No! The only opportunity I have. <laughs> Talking about the car, hmm? do you even know how to drive it well? Yes. Mm -hmm. Not when you have an accident, your mother will come to look for me. <laughs> oh, sweetheart, you're here. <laughs> uh, okay, dear, I want to talk with my daughter. Hmm? I'll see you next weekend. Yes, hmm? And I'll get you what you asked for. Yes, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. <laughs> okay, bye-bye. Mom, you sent for me. Yes, dear. Uh, it's actually a bit urgent. I'm going to be needing some money. Because hmm? I've sold off the last of your father's properties. This house we're living in is the last one remaining. But I thought you said Dad left a lot of properties. Which we've been spending since you were eight. Mommy, you shouldn't have sold his company. And missed the whooping 50 million back then. I'm not crazy, dear. Yeah. Besides, I couldn't run the company. That's not for me. I can't stress myself. <sighs> it's just that I'm beginning to feel financially insecure with Ovi. I was thinking I can run back home with my son, assuming he's broke. Hey! Don't you dare say that again. How could you think of leaving the marriage without getting anything for yourself? Look, he can't be broke. That man is very wealthy. I know, right? He's beginning to piss me off. I mean, how can I marry an old man with pot belly only to be managing? <laughs> Mommy, do you know what he even did? He brought his daughter to the house without informing me first. Mm -hmm. <sighs> you know, dear, just, just keep me informed, okay? I know how to handle him. It's just that he wasn't stingy before. Huh? And he can't be broke. He has a lot of investments. I think maybe he's beginning to get tired of me. Or he's seen someone else after giving him a child. <laughs> That's why I was very happy you had a boy, dear. You're not someone that can be pushed around anymore. Your leg is strong. <laughs> All right, Mom. Concerning the money you talked about, I will just transfer some money to you. Mm -hmm. I still have money in my savings. Oh, thank you, darling. <laughs> come, come, let me fix you something to eat. Yeah, Let's right. go to the I'm kitchen. so famished. <laughs> My dear, there are about 22 clans in our land. Hmm? Our people migrated to their present site around the 14th century. We are great warriors. We never back down in a warfare, but we never look for trouble first. And if you look for our trouble, then you've got it coming. They're also wise people. My grandfather told me about, uh, my, my great-grandfather told me about a war that he fought some, around the 16th century. It was a welcome. Uh, my boy. Uh, How are you? Hope you're okay. Mommy's tired, okay? I need to rest. Darling, you're welcome. Well, I was, you know, our people. Let me see, Mom. Maybe she's not feeling, you know. Let me just see her. I'll be back. Huh? Darling, 
Darling, there's something I don't want us to be doing. And that's fighting in front of our kids. I mean, get mad at me, fight me, do anything, but do not bring it in front of Eric or Pam for that matter. So this is all you have to say? So this is all you have to say when you can't give me the type of life that I deserve? I have told you, I have promised you that I'm going to make this vacation work. Just give me a time. I won't disappoint that you. That is my point exactly. Huh? How much time do you need? How much is vacation? Cheap vacation? How much is vacation? That you are telling me to, to, to give you time. All these excuses is becoming worrisome. And, and, and I'm not finding it funny at all. You don't mind, please excuse me. Just small vacation. Somebody will be doing that. It's a big deal. A big deal. How much is vacation? Ah! When love depends on what you are. Right. And when good love is. Depends on what you have When affection depends on all the things Yes, mom. The usual vacation I enjoy every year. I just sincerely hope that this man is not going broke. Mm -mm. That's not possible. That man has the biggest real estate company in the country. Then why am I no longer enjoying the money? Why? I'm worried as well. Look, you need to snoop properly. Check his phones. Find any evidence that incriminates him of cheating. Leave the rest to me. Just keep me updated. Hmm? All right, mom, I will. I will do as you've said. When love depends on what you are. <clears throat> And when good loving depends on what you have When affection depends on all the things you've got I bought you the tickets and I paid for the vacation You did? <laughs> oh, honey Why did you have me beg you first if you knew you had the money? I didn't have the money <laughs> I mean The money was meant for something else But I didn't like the way you started carrying on as if um, the world was going to come to an end if you didn't go on this vacation. Mm -hmm. So I had to deliver the money. Honey, ah, you have done so well. You know what? Don't worry. By the time we get to Paris, I'll make sure that you enjoy every single day. <laughs> but I won't be going with you. Why? I have some business days to close in a few days. I can't afford to be away from my office at this time. But you guys can go along. We'll have a family vacation sometime. Okay, if you say so. What's more important is that I, Uncle, will be going to Paris. <laughs> and you don't forget, you know it was only ticket you bought. You also need to send me some money for shopping. That place has really nice buildings and I have to slay. <laughs> Your wife will be slay. Oh my goodness. Darling, you are the when best. Did I ever tell you you're the best? You're the best. <laughs> I need to tell my friends you are the best. When good love <laughs> Honey, it depends on what you have. When affection oh depends goodness. on all the things you've got, then Wahala is inevitable. When more money. <laughs> Mom, I was beginning to think that he was getting broke. <laughs> the thought of it scared me. Me too. <laughs> But we still need to observe him, though. I don't like the fact that you need to beg and sulk before he gives you anything. You're right, Mom. But, Mommy, I am so excited about this holiday. I mean, I have always dreamt of visiting Paris since I was 21. Mm -hmm. And finally, my dreams are coming true. <laughs> now you see why I said you must marry a money bag. Mm -hmm. They literally make your dreams come true. <laughs> right, Mom? I am so excited. Mm -hmm. Mommy, I'm going to Paris. Mm -hmm. I am going to Paris. Mm. Mm. Come on to Tapel. Je m'appelle. <laughs> <laughs> when more money equals to more love. Mm -hmm. As you should. And be. when no money equals to no love. <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> 
you people are really enjoying yourselves. What of my grandson? You should have put him on the phone. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> Make sure you buy nice things. Hmm? <laughs> All right, darling. Bye bye. When the love you get depends on how much What's happening with the blocks today? There is fire. What? Yeah. Our own OVA. Yeah, yeah. What? What? Yeah, yeah. It be like say, it's so impossible to find someone to love you just for who you are. <laughs> I told you now. Hmm, that Paris vacation was so worth it. Ah! Oh, your girl is well rested. I guess what, if you see the fine, fine places there. God, I was always taking pictures. When I get here, I take pictures when I get here. I know me, I can't do without shoes now. There was even one shoe like that. Said, oh, Where are they? I got it for like 15,000. Oh, my son, you're back. <laughs> <laughs> my darling, how are you? Mm, your trip was good? My queen. Oh, please don't touch me. When will you stop embarrassing me? Huh? What do you even gain? Um, Eric, please could you go upstairs? Oh, daddy. The, darling, just go upstairs. Eh? I'll, I'll, I'll be with you soon. Nkori, what is it? How can you just come back into Nigeria and start yelling? When will you stop this attitude of yours? That doesn't even answer my question. My question is, where will you stop embarrassing me? I told my eyes for one minute and you've gotten a new girl. What? I beg your pardon. Don't worry, I'll show you. Who is this? But that's my new PA! Ah! <laughs> PA! PA, secretary, girlfriend, they're all the same. We know these tricks. You can't fool me. <laughs> At all. You know what? You need to fire her immediately. I will not fire her. All these things you are doing is female. You need to get yourself a male PA, not a female PA. Uh -uh. Listen carefully. I am involved in a huge contract that involves foreign partners. Mm. And she is the only one competent enough to work with me on this project. Mm. Do you know the long negotiations I've had to do in order to get her? I am sorry, I will not fire her. Mm. She must be very good then. Oh, yes. Yeah. Right. My friend, come off it. What, what's happening here? This is definitely not the girl I dated and married. Where is that sweet girl? Where is that sweet girl? It's you. You happened. You know what? I don't want to argue. I'm not. I'm a peacemaker. I don't like all these arguments. It's simple. That intelligent or whatever the girl is, I don't care to know. Fire her immediately, period. Otherwise, you will see crazy. You're gonna see crazy. Now, <laughs> let me warn you, Nkoli. You do not interfere with my work. Okay? I allow you to rant and rave in this house, it's all right. But when it comes to my work, steer clear. Because I've been working before I met you. And all the money you're spending comes from that work. Stay away. Ericsson, I'm coming up to see you now. And I'm sure you have a lot of stories for daddy. You're warned. You need to fire how? All this money, the money means nothing to me, oh. A faithful man is what every woman prays for. Money is nothing. How much? How much are you giving me? You can't be unfaithful to me. You said that that man may have found someone else. I couldn't believe it when I saw it in the blogs. Some people say she's his PA and some say it's his girlfriend. What nonsense PA? Mommy, have you seen that girl? She's, she's hot. And he says he won't fire her. My point exactly. Mm. Then it's time. Time for what? Yeah, yeah. Oh, na, 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 na. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. When love depends on what you are, and when good loving depends on what you have, when affection depends on all the things you've got, then wahala is inevitable. When more money equals to more love And when more money equals to no love When the love you get depends on how much you can offer There is fire on the mountain You know what, Chief? Mm. This is what we need to do more often. Yes. We meet with friends, you know, relax, eat some good meals, instead of always walk, walk, walk all the time. Right. It's true. You know? This is this is quite good. I agree completely. Mm. Madam, thank you so much. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. mm. Now, Chief. Yes. What about those properties you told me you are putting up for sale? Oh, they're still for sale. I'm waiting for some buyers. But, mm. Okay, in that case, I'm, I'm interested. You? Yes. <laughs> Why not? I won't be surprised. Mm -hmm. That's good. As, that's a matter good. Of, as a matter of fact, I discussed with my wife and she likes them. So I'd like to get them. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's interesting. The documents are upstairs. We'll okay. go and look at them. Alright, no problem. Oh, lovely. Lovely. Mm -hmm. properties go for an international market. Mm -hmm. I, I mean, I, 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 I'm promoting that for you now. Chief, I know. But why wouldn't I enjoy the benefits of having you as my mentor in the case? Hey, like our mentors do not eat because they have people <laughs> that are mentors. Well, what do you do? There's one thing you need to know, Chief. You know I'm buying these properties for my wife. 
And if you refuse to re lower the price, I will tell her. You see, you see, you, <laughs> you, this is black man. <laughs> this is black man. <laughs> now you want to bring my dad inside that? Oh, this this boy is out. So I don't, I don't want you to report me to my dad. Mm -hmm. um, okay, I will bring it down. Bring it down for her. In fact, report me to Madame so that I'll use my mouth and tell her that was because of her I brought it down, not thank you, you, not thank you. you. Thank you very much, sir. Oh, all right. Thank you, Chief. Yes. Uh, uh, darling, darling, uh, uh, honey, I, are you okay? Yeah, sure. Um, please, can you get me my wine? Um, you said what? My wine, please. Get <laughs> Thank you. Oh, yeah. Um, my boy Mbom mm. has something to tell us. Oh, really? Yes. Yes, madam. Uh, first of all, I would like to thank you once again for that lovely meal. Mm. Thank you so much. Uh, but the major reason why I came here is because I came to inform you, sir, that my multi-millionaire property on the island, that one you, I took it to when I was, you know, yes. I've completed it. Whoa. As a mother of I completed it two weeks ago. Whoa. Wow! Yes. Congratulations! It's done. Thank you. Done. Completed. You are a man. Thank you. Sir. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Thank you. Is that what we are talking about? <laughs> it, it comes for a celebration. Yes. You know that is why I and my wife felt that it would only be proper for you as my mentor and biggest supporter over the years to be the first to step into the house with your lovely wife. So we are inviting oh. you specially today, right away. Oh. I have to take the two of you. To that house right now. Oh. No long talking. Sure. Uh, no long talking. <laughs> Let me go um, change something more comfortable. No problem. Exactly. No problem. Please. Please. Thank you. Thank Please. you, madam. Uh, I'm ready. I'm You're ready. ready. Yes, okay, so let me just wait in the car. All right. right. While madam gets ready. All right. All right. Thank Please. you very much. Please. We'll be, we'll be right. with you now. No problem. Yes. Thank you very much. Yes. Mm. that Senator ate last. I completely disposed the bottle. Mm. So, I am clean. 
You are your mother's daughter. <laughs> now everything is yours. <sighs> right, mommy. But he left uh, one of his houses at Tikoi for his daughter. And then the one that the father left to. But mommy, you should have been there when the lawyer read his will. Mm. Senator is boxed up. Mm. <sighs> but this one that the will said you can't sell anything until Eric is 21. Isn't that a problem? Ah, it's not a problem at all, mommy. I didn't even intend selling anything. I would just list them out and then make money out of it. Anyway, he has lots of properties, unlike your father. The proceeds from them, his shares and investments, are enough to last us till the next generation. So I'm good. <laughs> now, let's talk about a vacation. Where are we going? Uh, mommy, uh, vacation now? We can't do that now. It's going to raise suspicions. Besides, Senator just died. But they have their killer already. Anyway, you can stay and mourn. You're his wife, after all. I am free as a bird, and I want to go on vacation, because I need it, and this money won't spend itself. <laughs> right. You earn it, Mom. Mm -hmm. I mean, if it weren't for you, I wouldn't have been this rich at 30. Mm. You earn it. <laughs> Her mother's daughter. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Rich? Can't uh, uh, darling? Darling? Uh, uh, honey! I, are you okay? Yeah, sure. I'm... I couldn't do it, Mom. You need to stop delaying and calling. One day you wake up to divorce papers and everything gone. He has the best lawyers, you know. And the man is still waxing strong with his so-called PA. I can't commit murder. Yes. I can't. Nkoli, are we still at this phase? Are we still talking about this? That man is not a saint. Do you think he would have gotten to the position he's in now without getting his hands dirty? Who even told you that his wife actually died of cancer? They have a way of manipulating these things, especially when the killer is influential. Look, you don't know what he's planning against you, especially now that he has a girlfriend. Just call it self-defense on you. I could have been caught. They could have found a way to trace it back to me. I think I have to find another time to do it. I still have the substance. The sooner. Cause the love of money is the root of so much evil. Yeah. Then go call it honey when the rabbi did it. When the money did it. Then be acting funny when he be like say in no day. All because of money they can do anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When love depends on what you are. Mm -hmm. And when good loving. Depends on what you have When affection depends on all the things you've got Then wahala It's inevitable When more money Honey? Oh, you... You see, you're back You seem to be so distracted these days Is anything the matter? Nothing, nothing. Is it the, the business I talked about? You want to start something now? No, no, no. Um, not at all. Okay. How, how is your PA? Yeah. She's gone. But I, I told you we were working on a project and she is a guru in that department. The project is finished and she's gone. Where's Eric? Um, He's, he's upstairs in his room. All right. Let me just go upstairs. Are you coming along with me? Uh, no, I'm fine. I'm, I was about checking something. You know what? I'll just get something for you, okay? All right. All right. 
Cause the love of money is the root of so much evil. Yeah. Them go call it honey when they rap a day day. When the money day day. Them be acting funny when it be like say in no day. All because of money they can do anything. Yeah yeah yeah. When love depends. The fact that he has stopped working with her doesn't change anything. They could be seeing each other secretly. You may be right, Mom. He keeps complaining about my spendings lately. You know what? I'm just going to watch him a little more. There's I nothing to watch. Look, I know when a man has gotten tired in a relationship. And with everything Ovia is doing, it's obvious that he's tired. Don't let him take you unawares. Look, if it's too difficult for you to do, we could... Get some men involved. Which men? Thugs. <sighs> Mom, you seem to know a lot about this dance. Have you oh. done this before? Uh, no, no, it's not it's nothing like that. It's just, it, it's just, I'm just annoyed on your behalf. Uh, you gave this man your youth, your energy, your beauty to that ungrateful old bastard, and he'll discard you this way. You're right, Mom. I honestly don't deserve this. Hmm. So do the needful, darling. Hmm? Before this man takes everything away, even your son. Never. Let's, let's talk about something else, darling. Um, I'd like you to top up my account, please. And a bit more than last time. <laughs> But mommy, I sent you three million just three months ago. Darling, look at the size of this house. I'm always spending money on it. I have to maintain the property, dear. Hmm? Okay, fine. I'll just send you 500,000. 500 what? Are you trying to insult me? 500 what? Look. It's like this man is really starving you of money. We have to get through with this deal before this goes out of hand. You don't even have any savings. What am I going to do with 500,000 naira? Do the needful, Uncle. Do the needful. Cause the love of money is the root of so much evil. Yeah. Them go call it honey when they rap a day day. When the money day day. Them be acting funny when it be like say in no day. All because of money they can do anything. Yeah yeah yeah. When love depends. Hey, you're welcome. I was calling your number. You are not picking. What happened? Depends on what you there was traffic. When affection depends on all yes, I had to go and pick him up when I noticed um, you were not going to pick him up. You know, I don't like sending any other person. I, I either prefer you or I going. It's that kind of creates good memories in the mind of the child. Huh. Please, darling. Why? Why are you mad at me? What am I doing wrong with that? You are mad at me at this moment. If I'm doing something wrong, please tell me and I'll stop it. I love you and I can do anything oh, to please, make you Oh, please, happy. please, 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 please. Don't say things that you cannot do. When we got married, you promised me that you were going to treat me like an egg. But this, this, what do I get? Huh? Anything I ask you for is being turned down. No, that's wrong. Everything you ask for, I have done, except the Bentley that I still promised to buy for you when you turn 30. And, and I, do, I go to lens to do things, to put a smile on that your face. I don't see that smile on your face these days. Besides, married life should not be all about gifts and money. Or have you fallen out of love with me, my dear? Affection depends on all the things you've got. Mm -hmm. Then wahala, you see the 
inevitable When more money equals to more love And when more money equals to no love When the love you get depends on how much you can offer There is fire on the mountain Nkoli. Wow. Eric. Nkoli. So you look you. really good. So good to see you too. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. So how are you? I'm fine. How is your family? I am divorced. Mm. Sorry about that. You mind if we go somewhere and talk? Um. Just to talk. So that was how the marriage crashed. I'm so sorry. Sorry about what? I am not sorry. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sorry. So what about you? Have you been happy in yours? Um. If I am not mistaken, you're the reason we're not together today. I am sorry. I was naive. How could you allow your mom make major decisions for you? She ruined everything for us. Huh? We would have been together today. Nkali, I would not lie to you. I was really heartbroken and bitter. But seeing you today has made me forget everything. How have you really been? Are you happy? I read the blogs, you know. It wasn't what I expected. We were meant to be together. Can't you see it? I'm calling. They forced him. Yes. You heard me. Divorce him and let us have what we used to have. Please. Divorce him so we can have what we had back. You heard me right.
spelling are you okay? Lily, what, what's wrong? I can't do this. I, j I can't. I you can't what? I just can't. Darling, what can't you do? Listen, you're a good woman. No matter how you go about trying to act tough, one day, <laughs> When you're tired of being someone else, you're going to stop and allow the whole world see your golden heart. I'm in a mess. I don't know I caught myself into it, but I really want to get out. Then talk to your husband. Talk to me. If I tell you, you're going to hate me. Let me be the judge of that, my love. Are you sure? Let me hear it. Okay, I'll tell you everything. Darling? Oh. Darling. All right. You're neither asleep nor awake. It's good. Just lie down as you are. Let me get into the kitchen and prepare the most sumptuous meal. Huh? All right. All right. I'll be back soon. Yeah. When love depends on what you are And when good loving depends on what you have Why haven't I gotten his itinerary for next tomorrow? He doesn't, he doesn't know it yet. Please, I need to get it latest tomorrow. Okay. Nkoli. What's going on? Is there something you're not telling me? We can't afford to have any slip-ups here. Hmm? It's Eric. Your son? No more, my ex. He wants me back. Oh, please forget about that one now. That's not what we should be talking about. We need to plan this thing properly. This man was a senator four times in this country, married to a younger woman. Who do you think they'll look at when something goes wrong with him? We need to plan this thing meticulously to ensure nothing comes back to you. Focus. Cause the love of money Keep your head in the game so much evil. Okay Yeah Them go calling honey When they rap by day day When the money day day Them be acting funny When it be like saying no day All because of money They can do anything Yeah 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 When love depends on what you Call it. are When Call it. loving depends on what you are um, uh, do you have something to tell me? Uh, mm, no. Why did you ask? It's obvious something is eating you up. Um, nothing, nothing, nothing at all. Um, how was work? How is work going? Good. Okay. Are you are you going to the office tomorrow? Definitely. I'll be going to my Koyo office at 9 a.m. Oh, okay. That means you'll be passing through Obalende. Won't there be traffic at Obalende? Well, either way, it doesn't really matter. My appointment is for 12 noon, so I'll be in my office uh, early enough. No, no. And you, how has your day been? Fine, fine. Okay. Uh, that means you'll be passing through Obalende for your meeting tomorrow. Oh, yes, definitely. Why do you ask? Nothing, nothing. I just, um, I'm just trying to make sure you're fine and your usual day. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Um, I need to pick this. It's, it's, it's mom. Excuse me. I will send it. I will send it. Yes, Mom, I will. 
Okay. Hi, Eric. Cause the love of money is the root of so much evil. Yeah. Them go calling honey when they rap a day day. When the money day day. Them be acting funny when it be like say in no day. All because of money they can do anything. Yeah yeah yeah. When love depends on what you are. Mm -hmm. And when good loving. Depends on what you have When affection depends on all the things you've got Then wahala It's inevitable When more money Equals to more love And when no money Equals to no love When the love you get Depends on how much you can offer there is fire, there is fire on the mountain. Yeah. Cause the love of money is the root of so much evil. Them go call you honey when they rap a day. When the money they day. Them be acting funny when it be like saying no day. All because of money. You're not okay. See the way you're looking. Well, maybe I shouldn't go to work today. Oh no, please. You said you have a meeting today. Yeah, you are more important to me than any meeting. You have to go. I'll be fine. But are you sure? Mm -hmm. Are you sure? I promise you I'll be okay. You sure? If you say so. Uncle, how far? Has he left? Um, uh, Has the senator gone out? Yes, 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 mom. Good. That's just what I wanted to know. Hmm? Don't panic, okay? I've got this. Just ensure you go out to see Eric so you have a strong alibi, okay? Time for business. Cause the love of money is the root of so much evil. Yeah. Them go call you honey when they rap by day. day. The you know, I can't believe that you called to see me again today. I'm calling. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You've been acting strange since you came here. Is everything okay? It's fine. What did you say again? I'm glad to see you again. Uh, I'm alright. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad too. Glad too. Babes, are you sure everything is fine? Okay. 
Yeah, everything is fine, of course. Nicole, it's really, really good to see you again today. Yeah. I've missed us being together and I would really love us to be together. I can't wait to... I can't wait for you to be in my arms and um, <laughs> hold you really tight and kiss you again. We can work on that. I wish I had you. I wish I had you all by myself. I would take you away from here very far away and just and just keep you to myself. Divorce him ASAP. Come on. I still have my family to consider. And besides, I can't just pick my bag and leave. Well, I know you're referring to your son and not that old hag. You know, you can actually fight for your son. He's still very young. You just need to fight for him. this when next we see. I I need to go. So that means we're seeing the game. Look, I really cherish this moment a lot. And I'm glad that you're giving me a second chance. Trust me, if you do give me the second chance, I would never let it go. I would not blow it. You just need to trust me, babes. him so what's all this fuss about killing him but why kill him because he wants to use and dump you remember mother you don't have to believe everything you see on the blogs oh he is a good man he's a loving husband a caring husband and a wonderful father where is all this coming from honestly i i had not been myself for months now mother you want me to kill my husband, a full human being. Mother, that man has been nothing but a caring person to me. He takes care of me, he makes me breakfast, he pays our son. He provides everything that I want and I need and he allows me to be completely myself. So tell me, mother, why would I love such a man? <laughs> now you love him. Few days ago you were cheating with your Eric. And now you want to play the angel. Mother, it took me to give him up for mother to realize how much I love him. But mom, mother, how did you even arrive at that? You are a fool. And by the time you realize what you just did to yourself, don't come crawling back to me. Oh, come on, mother. You don't have money anymore. You have finished spending all that money. I don't want to be like you. That's the reason why I have to be a good wife to my husband. Now you get to taunt and laugh at me. Me! Who was there to take care of you all these years. 
send you to the best schools, get you the best clothes, take you on the best vacations. It was me. You think all that would have been possible if I hadn't made money from your father? But he was my father. And he would have still spent all that money on me. He was going to chase us out, you fool. He was dating a younger woman. He was engaged to her. Why do you think I hooked you up with older men all these years? It was to get back at him. You were supposed to use and dump them. And not the other way round. Mother, that is sick. Tell that to the women who were frolicking with my husband while I was all alone. How am I miserable? Tell that to your father who emotionally abused me, making me feel like I was good for nothing except to pop out babies and be his personal chef. And then he wanted to throw us out like rubbish. But I outsmarted him. What do you mean by you outsmarted him? I did it all for you. I did everything for you. And now, I ask you to get rid of this old man. And you say no. Aside from his money, what else is it that you're getting from him? What else? Because I'll be damned if you tell me sex. But uh, you... You just said that... You had to do what you had to do. Does it mean that... You... Killed Dad? Mom, you said you haven't killed anyone before. I, I don't want all of you to be the first. It's not worth it. Mother, I love you. I love you very much. I will never abandon you. You know what? Myself and my husband were going to fix an allowance for you. 100,000 euros or something every month for you. Just Sit to down. make sure. Sit down. Listen to me. Handouts will never be the same as when the money actually belongs to you. That was what your father wanted to do. To give us miserly handouts. But I was bold enough to take it all. Yes, I killed him. Not regret it. Do the same thing with Ovier. I live a life of luxury. It will be easier for you because you have a son. Do it and you will not regret it. Be your mother's daughter. That was a good job, Mrs. Ovier. You could have had it all! 
Never had to lift a finger for the rest of your life. Now he's going to use you. And throw you away when he finds a new toy to play with. Madam, you are under arrest. Move out. Madam, move. Move. You lied to me. You lied to me that my father was murdered. Only for you to be the murderer. You may not believe this, but I love my husband. Yes, he may be older than me, but I love him dearly. He killed my father when I was eight years old and left me with daddy issues, remember? I will never cheat on my husband with Eric. I never did. Mother, I didn't want to be like you. I am ready to start a business of my own now. And yes, I am ready to lift all my fingers. Mother. Are we no longer going to the station? Move up. Mother, move, move. All I did was get some policemen I knew to come and arrest her and put some fear in her so that when she comes out, she won't come after us, you know? But I'm just coming from the police station. I just, I've dropped all the charges. Okay. Now, I don't know how to feel about this. I mean, the two talks, they've been released. My mom, she's so unrepentant. What if she comes after us? Exactly what they said at the police station. Said if I drop my charges, that means these hoodlums will also have to be released and they could carry on with their criminal activities on other people. Mm. But you know, her confession to your dad's murder is a capital offense and they won't let that go. In fact, they are not letting that go because it doesn't concern me. Darling, we didn't see that coming. Don't worry, everything's going to be okay. Hmm? Mm. I don't want you to stay. Come with me. Let me go and massage away the, the sorrow. Come on. Let me give you an old man's touch.
Hey babes, what's up? Hi, Eric. How are you? Okay. Oh yeah, sure, we, we can. You, you, you want us to meet somewhere? You know what, I don't think I want to do this anymore. I'm in love with someone else. What is it? What are you talking about? You are in love with someone else and you did not tell me? What is wrong with you? Look, I thought we'd discuss this. I, I told you just to give me another chance and then I'm going to do everything to prove that I really love you. I cannot stand losing you again, please. No, Eric. Who is this person that you chose over me? Your first love? It's no other person but my husband. Okay, and I choose him again over any other man. Please. I want to be with my husband. I don't want this anymore. Can you kindly delete my number? Thank you. When affection depends on all the things you've got mm -hmm. Then wahala It's inevitable oh, yeah. When more money Equals to more love na, na, na. And when no money Equals to no love yeah. When the love you get depends on how much you can offer There is fire There is fire On the mountain yeah. Cause the love of money is the root of so much evil. Them go call you honey when the rapper they when the money they dead. Them be acting funny when it be like saying no day. Nah, All nah. because of money they can do anything. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Cause the love of money is the root of so much evil. Yeah. Them go call you honey when the rapper they when the money no day Them be acting funny When he be like saying no day All because of money They can do anything So I went to you inside the house What have you been doing here? You've been here for so long My husband I just want to say I'm sorry I'm sorry for being such a difficult woman. Today, before God and before us, I promise to be a good wife to you. I want to be your peace. I want to take care of you. I really, really do love you. And I want our marriage to work. to you. I don't know what came over me. Please. Henceforth, I promise to be a good mother to you. To love you and to care for you. You deserve all the good things of this world. Please find a place in your heart to forgive me, okay? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank oh. you. You asked Pamela to come over? Uh, honey, I, I asked the 
The driver to pick her up, uh, it was meant to be a surprise. A very pleasant <sighs> and wonderful surprise it is. <laughs> it's nothing really. Yeah. Pamela. Who's that? This is beautiful. <laughs> okay, uh, uh, the table is set. Let's uh, have lunch. Okay. But first, you need to help me out. I was still bringing out some food from the kitchen. Just join me, right? Hey.